Oh, I'm excited about it. Our team is great. Uh, love the team. So when this project was brought to me, I had been waiting for an opportunity like this. Um, I didn't hesitate to say, like, yeah, I'll definitely do it. Like this, like a real world chance to like use your engineering um, to actually work with an organization in partnership. Um, that cares about these things and to like kind of like build something from like the ground up. We can use our engineering knowledge to try to contribute to like some societal change for some people to like help improve their lives on like a very core level like teaching someone how to fish as opposed to like just like building this really cool fishing rod. Like I was all about it. Yeah. <laughs> like I'd always been thinking of like how to give back to the continent, right? How to give back to um, the place where I was born and the place where I was raised and things like that. You know, there's not a lot of places that I want to go in the world, but West Africa is one of those places. So. I am here as a partner um, and I'm not saying, oh, I'm building this for you from Stanford. Like, this is for you. You're, 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 you're welcome. Um, it's a collaborative process and it's not easy. Like, why, what's the point of having all these, you know, black and brown kids going to like computer science, for example, if you're just going to work at Facebook? That doesn't make sense to me. Um, and so a project like this is something where people Diasporic, African diasporic people, you know, like myself, um, Andrew, other people on the team, can work to use our skills that we've leveraged from Stanford to help people like us who need it. Um, and so that, that's ideal, right? Like, this is the reason why we learn STEM skills, is to help our communities. And so this is like the embodiment of like kind of everything I've wanted to do with my engineering degree. Well, I am so thankful that I have this opportunity to work on something um, during my four years where I have the resources too to make something impactful. I declared it mechanical engineering, but I was like, do I even like this? I'm not sure because all I'm doing is problem sets and I don't really know what this means for my career path. Um, so without those talks of social justice or even just making an impact, it's really hard to imagine what you truly can do once you graduate. Um, like I said, I'm from Ferguson, Missouri, so I was here when things happened back home. So I think that also kind of, kind of sparked like, what's the real purpose of why I'm here? Why at this time and place do I have this blessing to study mechanical engineering? Um, and how can I use my degree to give back to others? One of the things I've been trying to think about is, you know, I'm very interested in aeronautics and astronautics, but like, I don't really see how sending a satellite into space puts food on the table for someone, you know, um, in Cincinnati. So I'm trying to think about ways to bridge like these very new and exciting technologies to actually helping people, um, particularly domestically and not forgetting people here is important to me. Working with professors who are conscious like that about like the wide scale of issues that like people have and like how we can use our engineering to like help people as opposed to just build cool things is really what I'm trying to do like throughout my like next couple years here and like develop my own ability to see the need um, the needs of people before the cool thing being built. I'm just excited to meet people that we've been like Skyping with. They just have felt so far away and to have the opportunity to meet them in person, I'm really excited. Yeah, like this is um, sort of the work that um, is important to be doing. Um, I feel like um, I could take classes and learn for 10 weeks, but um, I don't think I would have it would, it would impact me or impact anyone else <laughs> um, as much as this, a project like this would impact real people's lives. 
I like to think we're paving the way for some really cool things to happen here at Stanford.